Yo, what's going on? Welcome to my channel, John Kendrick Tech TV. What I'm going to be doing is showing you a tutorial or a preview of the Dig Digs MS build. Um, I'm going to be going through the menus, the sub menus, um, showing you the movie hub to TV hub, um, kids on all the features and, 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 and um, add ons within the build. Now, this is running on my Apple TV 4K, running the tvOS 11.3. Uh, once again, these are all the sub menus and hub menus within the build. Um, I did install this from Digs, the Vault version 2 repository, uh, which is a build of 8 and 1. You get to choose which ones you want to add. Um, let's start off by going through the new releases session. Right here, you have a number of new movies that they just added, um, not only to <clears throat> this build, but to Cody and the add-ons that it comes with, um, mostly from 2018. What I'm going to do is just choose a movie, a random movie. It doesn't really matter. Um, show you that it plays. I'm not going to let it get into the movie because I don't want to get any violations from YouTube, man. So the first one I think I chose is Cinderella. Yep. Um, you get to choose if you want to watch the trailer. You know, SD, HD, 720p, open load, or real debris. I have a real debris account, so I chose that. That's just a private network where you can um, choose movies from private streams and um, private servers that are not, you know, um, doesn't have too much traffic with other people that are streaming. And as you can see, it plays, man. I'm going to stop it right there. Go on to the Movie Hub. <clears throat> the Movie Hub is mainly going to be the most popular movies out right now. Um, not only just in theaters, but, you know, um, released for store and um, online streaming as well. It has movies that you'll find on Hulu, movies you'll find on Netflix, Movies you'll find in theaters, movies you'll find that's just released or whatever. It has it. Um, here I chose to show you that Bear, um, Bird Box does play. You see at the bottom left, it's calculating. It's going through scrapers. It's going to pull it right on up, man. Um, the way I have my setup is awesome. And as you can see, it's playing now. And I'm just going to stop it right there. I don't want to let it play too long. I don't want to get any violations, man. But you can see it is accessible. I don't pay for a Netflix account. I don't pay for a Hulu account. I don't pay for um, any of that, man. Amazon Prime. Well, I do, but I don't stream my movies from Amazon Prime. Here I'm going through the TV hub, uh, man. It has all the latest um, and hottest TV shows that are out right now, most popular. Um, Netflix, Hulu, HBO, Stars, Showtime, whatever. Um, here I'm going to choose, I know it's popping right now, You, it's a um, brand new show, I think it's found on Netflix, um, it has all the episodes in the first season, you can choose to watch it, once again, I do not pay for this service, it's free, um, the only thing I pay for is who I choose to stream my movies and TV shows from, which is Real the Bread, um, from my understanding, like I said, it's a private server, and it doesn't have that much traffic or it, it distributes the traffic from the service that you choose to stream the movies and TV shows from. Very limited buffering and everything else. So next, I'm going to go to the Kids Zone. And this right here has all the latest and best uh, movies for kids. Um, I think I chose to show the Jungle Book going through the session. So that's what I'm going to do, man. Um, there you go, the Jungle Book. Uh, released in looks like 2016 so yeah it's gonna go through the scrapers it's gonna pull it up it's gonna play i'm not gonna show um you know longer than a second on the movie i'm gonna stop it just to let you know it does play man um great quality it is fast it's easy it's simple it's free so yeah that's the jungle book opening scene um, I'll just go ahead and stop it. Next, we're going to go through the urban section, which is going to be all your black classics, um, house party, um, each of the house party, um, each of the Fridays, bad boys, the throwbacks, fresh, um, 
you know, everything, man. It, it has it. You know, it's going to search. It's going to do the scraping. Those are the different add-ons. I don't have it on autoplay or select um, a certain add-on. I get to choose the add-on that I wanted to um, watch it from. As you can see, um, the add-on I have set up in SDS Reader, it is set to autoplay and auto-choose. So, yeah, I just click. And it's going to go right on through, man. Do a scraping. And why? Wow, it's going to play. And, you know, right here I was trying to fast forward and go through the, um, I'll show you that it is the actual movie. Um, so that's what I was doing. I was accidentally turning down the volume. And then I went ahead and skipped about 10, 15, 30 minutes into the movie just to show you that it actually plays. This is Fresh, one of my favorite movies. In the black community, man, voila, I'm going to go ahead and stop it. Don't want to get any violations from YouTube. Here, this is my live TV session. Now, um, I do have this set up. I had to manually set this up. It didn't come customly built into the build. Um, I'm not even going to play any channels. I'm just showing you the wide variety of um, selections and, and choices you have, man. Um, as you can see, it's on and on and on. Trust me, it does work. Um, with the setup that I have with my Apple TV, can't personally speak for Fire Sticks. This is better than um, DirecTV. Spectrum, um, whoever you you have your service with, um, it's pretty it's pretty reliable. Much cheaper option. I rocks with it. It gets a thumbs up for me. Yeah, I'm just going through. You know, like I say, all the channels, all the um, options you have, the different varieties, sports, movies, um, MTV, BET, um, you know, Nickelodeon, all the different channels, man. Shout outs to them. I'm not going to play any other services. Um, I just want you to see that it's accessible. It's available. Um, this right here you can get for um, the actual services is about $15 a month. The guide is two dollars and fifty cents, or three dollars and fifty cents, so a total of eighteen fifty for a month. This right here is all your reality TV shows, everything that's available, everything that's hot, everything that's popping. Um, I told us to go to the latest, Keeping Up with the Kardashians. So, yeah, that's what that is. That's what I'm going to be showing you here. Just let it go through the scrapers. Let it do what it do. I accidentally went up so it didn't play. So I'm going to have to click on it once again. Um, that's the thing about these Apple TV remotes. That's why I mainly control it either from my phone or from my Nimbus controller. Much easier. I don't accidentally press um, buttons because on the Apple TV it's like a little touchscreen touchpad. So... Yeah, man, that thing is 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 pretty. It's wild, man. It has a mind of its own. The slightest movement, um, it's gonna do an option to select. It's very sensitive. So yeah, man, this is um, keeping up with the Kardashians. I don't know why it's showing like that. Um, I'm assuming it was just this episode. If not, it was just this episode. I can actually choose um, to stream it from a different um, add-on or a different. Um, online server here right here you have the documentary session I'm not uh, a fan of the choices of variety the music the media streamers like YouTube sports Android your add-on sessions your settings go into the settings man this is where you can uh, pretty much uh, make it to what you're comfortable with you go into the skin settings a lot of people don't know but you can customize um, the bills to fit your needs. You go into here, and as you can see, um, I have this all set up to where it fits my needs. Um, I did mess with the um, the widgets, and I messed with the sub menu and and the actions to where it actually. Um, I set up Movie Hub and TV Hub to where if I click on it, I can actually go to search whatever I want to watch, because it didn't come like that installed already. So yeah, man, that's that's a great feature. Um, go down to add-ons you can pretty much um configure the settings for each add-on that you have video add-ons i'm gonna go over here to scrubs and a lot of people don't know um 
if 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 you have Exodus or Scrubs or 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 uh, whatever post, um, I do know you can go and you can configure the settings to shorten down a provider's searching timeout from sixty seconds to actually ten seconds. That's why I hurry ups and plays. Then you can actually set it to autoplay and to view the movie in in the background whenever you um, you know back out of it. Um, I do have a 4K device, so I had a 4K quality um, set. And, yeah, man, that's how you pretty much customize and edit everything, man. Get into that, fiddle around with those settings. You won't regret it. It can increase um, and improve your experience with Cody, with the builds you choose, and everything else, man. Um, at the top left, the digs repo, ddns.net. That's where you can install this build from. So you would add that to the um, ad source and file managers. Once again, it's John Kendrick TV, man. I'm checking out. If you have any questions, just hit me up.